Muslim curries are one of the most complicated of Thai curries. It's a sweet and sour curry from the Muslim community of Thailand. It's made from grilling dried chilies, red shallots, garlic, some galangal and lemongrass with pounding it with various dried spices. Some mace, some cumin, some Thai cardamom, some clove, coriander, nutmeg and cassia. It's a very complicated curry paste but it's a delicious one. Let me show you how it's made. And you just simply put some dried chilies, put them onto a skewer and we'll char grill them or we'll grill them. Very easy to do. Some chilies, some shallots, some Thai garlic, some lemongrass, and some galangale. All of which need to be grilled and then pounded to a paste. Okay, so we'll take this over to be grilled. While the chilies and shallots and garlic are grilling, I'll toast some of the dried spices that go into the Muslim and curry paste. Some coriander seed, some mace, Thai cardamom, some cloves, some cassia, and some cumin seed. This is toasted off until it's aromatic, and then we'll grind it to a fine powder. You have to be careful not to let the spices become too coloured, otherwise they'll be burnt. Now that the spices have cooled down, I'm going to grind them up to a fine powder and add it to the Muslim and curry paste. And after a few minutes, the spices have been ground to a fine powder. And it's important that it is a fine powder because you don't want the grittiness of the spices themselves in the curry paste. And here are some of the ingredients already grilled. They need to be charred and soft because the Muslim curry itself needs, is quite smoky. So the dried chilies are ready to come off. Easy, really. And what you need to do is just take out all the seeds. You know, you could leave the seeds in the curry, but it's, it'll be too spicy. The galangal comes off, the lemongrass peeled off, and then we slice it. The shallots are peeled and the garlic I'm just going to leave it just like that then we pound the paste by adding the grilled chilies a little bit of salt and now the paste is just about ready You can see it's quite fine. Now I'm going to mix the spice in. A 
Okay. Here is the Musulman curry paste. 